Don't go to the law. East River, George Family Play Mantis A system. Gatekeeper means the system of the head. My father already is a gatekeeper. So should be his son, the next generation should be a gatekeeper, not for other people. But the son have to have, have a real good level to be a gatekeeper. My father passed on me because my father has to see what I'm doing. That's why he came. I just want to carry on the real system. The system about about the power. <coughs> the real system, of course, is a hard work. It's hard work. I don't teach open door. I don't accept people so easily because I teach really traditional. Follow the old way. <laughs> Nowadays, modern day, people want instant, very quick, but in the system, to get power cannot be quick. People will not, never understand the real Kung Fu because they think. They have power, but it's a physical, just body, body power. Usually people come up to ask me, ah, people have got power already. I just want the technique to defend myself. I said, no, you're already very weak. You cannot defend yourself without any power. And they don't believe it. So I have to show them the real power in the system housing. And then they realize. Until they realize, it doesn't mean they want to learn. Physical power means your own power from your body. But the soft power, it means like I'm talking to you is someone holding a cigarette or fire to burn your elbow and then you get a uh, moving. That moving is to become a shock. It's very quick and fast because you get the pain and then you can have a such, such kind of shock. But we have to develop such power any time to use it, any time. There's no need to get pain and then to, to do it. Your physical power has to change to become shock. The shock power is come from your body bring out to your elbow, to your bridge and become shock. Usually people have no power in the bridge. Bridge means hand. People have no power in the hand, only in the body. So when they fight, they like grab, grab, grabbing, uh, like wrestling, grabbing, because no power in the hand, no bridge. That's why you speak using body. People will never understand it. Until they touch me, they touch my bridge, they touch my hand, and they feel it. When they feel it, they're surprised. They're surprised. In a, in a very short range, no space, and develop such an explosion power. In the future, in the future, die out. No more, no more left. That's what I think. Who we keep? Hard to say. Could be Hungarian, could be English. But the thing is, they carry on, do they really interested? For some people, it might be strange to see people training in an underwear. But it is very common in Hong Kong, and it has a few reasons. The first and most practical reason is that it is very hot and humid most of the time. 
Another reason is that the master can see better the mistakes of the students. As a third reason, it also shows the very close connection between the students and the master as they train together and he let them see how he is using his body. Yeah, yeah. What keep on going? Because I never have to feel myself good enough. In the system, the real Kung Fu, no ending. Level is no ending. Always go up, go up the level. You learn the techniques, one day we end. The form, the techniques, one day we end. Power never ends. Improve until you die. Never end. Techniques will end. Doesn't mean anything. Techniques doesn't mean anything. Nothing more important than power. Nothing important than power. The power comes from your hip, your elbow, your stand, everything. It's the foundation. Without power, what technique you can use it? May I happy to see? Uh, of course, I want to see in Europe, everybody to know about the system. It, it doesn't matter about me. I don't care about myself. I'm not, I'm not Superman. I'm not a Kung Fu fantastic. I want people to know about the system. What is the real Kung Fu look like? That's, I wish people to know about this in Europe. But in China, Hong Kong, Asia, no, no, nobody interested. Only for your fear. This part of Kowloon City is very old. The headquarter building, the Mo Kun, was the apartment of late Grandmaster Ip Soi, father of Ip Chi Kun. They moved here from Hong Kong when Ip Chi Kun was very young. In the last decade, Hong Kong went through lots of changes and the government is getting rid of these old buildings and they are replacing them with new estates. That means this historical place, which is part of the Kung Fu history of Hong Kong, might disappear in the next 10 years or so. To all the building, government one day have to demolish. The place, since I was small, I grew up here, I learned the six come in here, I become European know about me, also from, from this place, that's a little sad. Yeah. Uh, it's part of the history, Sifu. Yeah. Part of the Kung Fu history. Yeah. That's life, Sifu. Many old schools, they don't exist anymore. It's alive. Okay. Uh, Let's go. Yeah. Okay.